Hello guys and welcome to this video. This video we're gonna talk about shortcuts or keyboard shortcuts. We know simply that there is there this shortcuts. It is a shortcut for a program. For example, this Google Chrome shortcut will go to a program and program file dot chrome dot something like that. If I go every time I want Google Chrome go to this folder, it will be a knockout to be problematic so this shortcut will simplify the use of this program there is keyboard shortcuts also that can do the same thing as this shortcut go Chrome shortcut but do a commands with just your keyboard click to two buttons it will give you an action click on two three buttons it will give you an action so like for example I will go to this document, yeah, yeah, and I will go to this sublist. For example, I want to copy this word. I will click on Control C, and I will go also to this document to paste it. So I click on Control V. Simple as that. And I will change also. And I want to copy another text like that. So I click on Control C, and I will, and I click also on Alt Tab to change the program that I copy paste it too and I click also control E as simple as that for using keyboard much better than using mouse if I go to this and click here click copy return to program you see it is waste of time it's not a good the it's not a big time but you can see that it is boring and the waste of time not like uh, using keyboard and mouse at the same time it is much fun you can use your PC and you control it 100% so this shortcut will will make the use of your terminal in general easier you will use it you will use it and you will use it to do with a lot of things that you can do in the, in the previous before knowing that shortcuts there's a lot of shortcuts not copy paste but there is two different shortcuts keyboard shortcuts this the shortcuts that work on just another just a system like Windows has its comments, Linux has its comments, uh, Mac OS has its shortcuts, and there is the shortcuts that work on all the you, all the OSs, all the system, all the operating systems, Windows, Linux, and Mac OS. For example, if I go to this copy paste command or shortcut, it will work on Linux and Mac OS and Windows, but if you go Alt Tab to see programs, it could not work in all systems. It's just this shortcut is just for Windows only, and there is a lot of comments, lot of shortcuts for Windows to use. It will it will make the change in your using applications this instant and. There's lot much, much better using, uh, better way of using this common. Uh, for example, uh, the way I did it, I use go to here, go to the text. For example, go to this text. Click on Control C, Alt Tab. Get to, to the other text. Go to Alt Tab, like that, and Control V. So when you have this mechanism in your brain to use alternate shortcuts to use your programs daily it will be much better and fun idea and way to use these shortcuts better than using mouse and keyboard only just for shaping shaping something like that and uh, now we're gonna go to the last thing to end this video it is the list of all windows shortcuts uh, because i don't know all of them we're gonna go to history keyboard you're gonna see all the commands here 
like for example control c copy the item of checks is not working all in microsoft word you work on all the programs you can programs operating systems anything but windows r windows r is not what be working in uh, linux because there is no run in linux or there's no explorer in linux uh, if you go to windows r it will give me when run but run there is no run in ubuntu or linux or mac os to go to this application so there is commands that will work in every os and there is commands that will not work like uh, windows alt 4 f4 it will quit on every program that you use it but it will not work on every os so this is the video this is an idea i want to share with you about it thank you very much for watching this video subscribe like this video or dislike it uh, share with your friends click the bell icon and thank you again for watching this video see you in the next one